high. So, are you stuck in backing up your chat on your WhatsApp and using your iPhone after the iOS 17 or later? Well, I was just trying to update my WhatsApp chat backup to my, well, iCloud Drive, but it was like, keep getting this backing up and it keeps spinning and it says get stuck 1.6 megabyte. Well, if you have the same problem here, or like here are the quick guidelines that you guys can try to solve your problems. First, all you have to really do, guys, you have to just make sure your internet is working fine. So uh, to quickly check about internet, you can just head over to your browser and just try to find out something. You can just open up the YouTube or just try to um, load up to the website just to see whether it works or not. So if you see it works or it works, uh, that all you have to do, you actually need to just um, head over to your control center. If it does work, enable airplane mode for about 10 to 20 seconds, disable that, or you can switch your mobile data to Wi-Fi or Wi-Fi to mobile data. Make sure your internet is completely working fine with your phone. And after that, just open up your settings on your iPhone, scroll down to general, you want to select uh, iPhone storage. And here, you just want to scroll down and you want to just find out your WhatsApp application. If you don't find them, or if you can't find them, just tap search and type WhatsApp, you will get it definitely. And tap offload, just tap offload again, and tap reinstall app. Now, once you restart your application there, all you have to do is get out of here and uh, just uh, reopen the app. And hopefully this time around, you will be able to install, or I mean, the, the, give it a chat backup on your iPhone without facing any trouble. Now, if you still have problems, then I would really tell you guys um, just to restart your device and see if that works or not. So still, as you guys can see, my problem is not solved yet. But if I'm going to just restart my device, then it will 100% work. Well, I can't do it because my I'm just uh, screen decoding my phone. But all I, guys, all I want you guys to do is just restart your device and your problem is going to be solved 100%. So this is it. If you still have any questions to ask, guys, please let me know in the comment section. See you all around.